What's up today, guys? Um, I'm gonna try to change this dizzy out. As you can see, look at that. I got oil in it at one time. Look how corroded that son of a bitch is everywhere. If I probably just change the cap, I'd probably be good. But there's corrosion right there. A few other spots. Looks like we got a little little oil leak again. But uh, I think we're just gonna change it. We're also missing. As you can see the seal so we we'll wonder waters me getting into it I'm messing with it as you can see seals right there on this one but we got a bolt busted off in this so what we're trying to do is extract it so we're gonna drill it extract it hopefully it'll work so I'll get back to you if it does okay here's another thing I noticed these wheels Look the same but different. See how you got little grooves on that up through it. This thing here is completely freaking smooth. That's definitely different than OEM. So I think I'm going to put this wheel into there as well. Oh shit, I'm never on pause the video. I'll have to skip that, but there it is. Gaskets in there. Uh, I'm going to try to clean this just a little bit. I don't know how I'm going to do that without fucking the spring up. So get something lightly to clean that real quick. And then, oh, yeah, you guys see, see the little button down here? Okay, that's for like your middle fire there. And you can look at that. That looks pretty war on that. Pretty shot out. That one not as bad. But where's it at? Where's our cap? Here's our cap we're changing. Look at the difference. This did have the copper style, which I like better. But look how much that sticks out. That's about completely wore out. Look at all the corrosion right there. And all the corrosion around every bit. This has none. Wish we had a better cap than this. But it does say Honda written on it, so. This one does not. So I like to take these guts, well not these guts, I like to put this distributor on it because I know this is a Honda distributor. So we put this distributor on it, it'd be much better than this. Advanced auto or wherever the fuck that may have came from. I'm going to clean this up and get this done because it's about to rain. Well, as you, now nah, there you go. Now you can tell. Well, I got tired of dicking around with it. So, um, these screws here to the connection were rusty here. The rest of it looked pretty good. I just got to get this, I got to mess with this another day and drill this out. And then I'll use this distributor I believe I just got to drill this out the reason why I didn't want to use this one is because see how it's someone stripped it out but I got a bolt here oh I stripped it out bad where's it at I got a bolt here I got the gasket in there so they didn't have no gasket in there this looks like it was rebuilt or a cheap piece of shit one and this one looks more like OEM because you can see the, like the plastic covers over everything and Things of that nature. And this right here was really bad. It's not bad now. It's just was a little corroded. Should be fine now. Corrosion should go away. Um, water was getting in it for sure. I'm not sure how bad that is. Can't even see in there, but looks pretty good. Um, they also didn't have the shield right here. I'm going to take that out. Take this button off here. And then we're going to put that shield in there. 
and then after that we're gonna seal this thing up I got a bolt to go through here and lock it down so everything should be good all right <clears throat> change the oil distributor now we're gonna see if this thing runs any better